Hi, my name is Laurel Hicks, registered prenatal yoga teacher and certified labor doula. I first came to teaching prenatal yoga when my sister was pregnant with her first baby. She talked to me about all the great benefits she felt every class, and that led me to take my first prenatal yoga teacher training. In 2007, I began teaching classes, and I haven't looked back since. Mindful Mama's Prenatal Yoga is a time for you to nurture your body and mind. It's a time to connect with baby, to get rid of all those little nuances that you may feel during pregnancy, all the back pain, maybe not sleeping well. And it's also a time to mentally and physically prepare yourself for pregnancy, labor, and parenthood. Many women who have practiced prenatal yoga with me have said that the classes have really helped them to embrace their entire pregnancy. It's helped them to focus and relieve stress. This in turn allows the mom to have a better experience during childbirth. The more relaxed the mom is, the more this helps to release endorphins in the body that can help lessen the intensity of contractions as well as even shorten the time in labor. I invite you to take the time to be mindful and cultivate awareness during your yoga practice. Enjoy the experience of being pregnant with your baby and embrace the changes that are happening within your body and your mind. This practice is for anyone, whether you're planning a natural childbirth, a birth with an epidural, or a cesarean birth. But please make sure to check with your doctor or midwife to make sure that prenatal yoga is safe for you. If you do go to a studio, ensure that you're going to a qualified teacher. Tell them about any health concerns and tell them that you're pregnant. Some women decide to avoid doing inversions during the last four weeks of their pregnancy. This is to ensure that baby's head remains down in the pelvis. These poses include downward dog, legs up the wall, forward bends, as well as shoulder stand or head stand if they're practicing that. If your baby is still head up or breech at 36 weeks, you may want to incorporate these inversions to help encourage baby's head to move downward. Once again, please check with your doctor or midwife to ensure that the poses that you're doing are safe for you.